Brought to you by wikivd.com. Carmella, wrestler. Leah Van Dale is an American professional wrestler, professional wrestling manager and model. Currently signed to WWE under the ring name Carmella, performing on the SmackDown brand. In June 2013, Van Dale signed a contract with WWE, and was assigned to their performance center in Orlando, Florida. In October 2014, she aligned herself with Enzo Amore and Colin Cassidy, thus also becoming their manager. In July 2016, she made her main roster debut on SmackDown. In June 2017, Carmella became the winner of the inaugural Women's Money in the Bank ladder match. Early Life Vin Dale grew up in Spencer, Massachusetts, a small town outside of Worcester. She attended the University of Rhode Island and later transferred to the University of Massachusetts Dartmouth, where she graduated with a bachelor's degree in marketing. After graduating, she became a cheerleader for the New England Patriots for three seasons, ending in 2010. She successfully auditioned for the Los Angeles Lakers dance team, appearing as a Los Angeles Laker girl from 2010 to 2011. NXT 2013-2016 in June 2013, Van Dale signed a contract with WWE, and she was assigned to the company's developmental territory WWE NXT in late September. In December, she announced that her new ring name was Carmella. Carmella made her debut on the September 4, 2014, episode of NXT, portraying a hairdresser in a segment with Enzo Amore and Colin Cassidy. Two weeks later on NXT, Carmella appeared in another segment with Amore and Cassidy at the WWE Performance Center, announcing that she had lost her job as a hairdresser due to Amore and Cassidy's actions, and asked for a job at NXT. She made her in-ring debut on the October 16 episode of NXT, fighting a local wrestler, whom Amore and Cassidy dubbed Blue Pants. Carmella defeated Blue Pants on two occasions, while portraying a villainous character despite her alliance with Amor and Cassidy, but lost to her on the January 1, 2015, episode of NXT after Amor accidentally caused a distraction. In March, Amor and Cassidy began a rivalry with the NXT Tag Team Champions Blake and Murphy while Carmella rejected Blake and Murphy's advances on several occasions becoming a fan favorite in the process. On the May 13 episode of NXT, Carmella was defeated by Alexa Bliss after a distraction by Blake and Murphy. A week later, at NXT TakeOver, Unstoppable, Bliss attacked Carmella during the NXT Tag Team Championship title match, ensuring the win for Blake and Murphy. While continuing to manage Amor and Cassidy, Carmella began feuding with Eva Marie, which led to a match between the two, on the August 26 episode of NXT, which Carmella lost on the September 23 episode of NXT, in a rematch, Carmella lost via count out, and the rivalry quietly ended, in the beginning of January 2016. Carmella received her first singles push as she won a battle royal to become the number one contender to Bayley's NXT Women's Championship. Carmella received her championship match against Bayley on the February 10 episode of NXT, but she was unsuccessful in capturing the title. After the match, Eva Marie and Nia Jax attacked the two, which led to a tag team match on the February 24 episode of NXT where Carmella and Bailey were on the losing side. Carmella made her first appearance on WWE's main roster on March 12 at Roadblock, accompanying Amor in Cassidy to their match against the Revival for the NXT Tag Team Championship. On the May 25 episode of NXT, Carmella competed in a triple threat match against Nia Dax and Alexa Bliss to determine the number one contender to ask as NXT Women's Championship. At NXT TakeOver, The End, which was won by Jax, 
On the August 17 episode of NXT, she competed in a six-woman tag team match along with Liv Morgan and Nikki Glenn Cross, in which they defeated Daria Berenato, Mandy Rose, and Alexa Bliss, which would be also her last match in NXT. SmackDown 2016 Present on July 19, Carmella was drafted to SmackDown as part of the 2016 WWE Draft. Carmella made her main roster debut for the brand on July 26, where she confronted the brand female talents before being interrupted by Eva Marie. Two weeks later, following an attack from Natalia on the August 2 episode of SmackDown Live, both women faced off on the August 9th episode of SmackDown Live, where Carmella achieved her first victory on the main roster by defeating Natalia. At SummerSlam, Carmella, Becky Lynch, and Naomi competed against Natalia, Alexa Bliss, and the returning Nikki Bella in a six-woman tag team match, where Carmella's team was defeated after she was pinned by Bella. On the August 23rd episode of SmackDown Live, Carmella attacked Bella before their scheduled singles match, turning herself into a villainess. For the first time during her time on the main roster, at Backlash on September 11th, Carmella competed in a six-pack elimination challenge to determine the inaugural WWE SmackDown Women's Champion, where she was eliminated by Lynch, who ultimately won the title. Carmella then continued her feud with Bella, competing against her on October 9 at No Mercy, where Carmella was defeated. She later stated that Bella's success was due to the popularity of her boyfriend John Cena. On the November 15 episode of SmackDown Live, she competed against Bella in match that ended in a no contest after Raw Women's Champion Charlotte appeared at ringside, causing a distraction and a brawl between all of the women of Raw and the women of SmackDown. At the Survivor Series pay-per-view, the SmackDown women's team went up against the Raw women's team in a 5-on-5 five -five elimination match, with Natalia replacing Bella as team captain after she was mysteriously attacked backstage, where Carmella's team was defeated. On December 4, Carmella lost to Bella in a no-disqualification match at the TLC pay-per-view later revealing that Bella's attacker at Survivor Series was Total Divas co-star Natalia, thus ending her feud with Bella. On December 20, Carmella started a storyline with James Ellsworth, professing that she found him uniquely attractive. On January 3, 2017, Ellsworth started accompanying Carmella to the ring during her matches. On the May 16 episode of SmackDown, Carmella scored a victory over Naomi in a non-title match. At Backlash, Carmella teamed up with Natalia and Tamina to compete against Flair, Lynch, and Naomi in a six-woman tag team match where Carmella's team was victorious. On June 18, Carmella was declared the winner of the first-ever Women's Money in the Bank ladder match. At the Money in the Bank pay-per-view after Ellsworth obtained the briefcase and dropped it to her, ending the match in controversial fashion. The following Tuesday, General Manager Daniel Bryan stripped Carmella of the Money in the Bank contract on SmackDown Live, issuing a rematch between all five women for the following week. On the June 27 episode of SmackDown Live, Carmella was victorious after she retrieved the briefcase herself officially becoming the inaugural winner of the women's money in the bank ladder match thank you for watching brought to you by wikivd.com please like and subscribe below please like and subscribe below